Hello everybody and welcome back. I've decided to take the plunge and supplement my Viper Spectre LED lights with a T5 hybrid fixture. This is a uh, four lamp fixture made by Aquatic Life. Let's go ahead and unbox this and see what we have in the box. I also have the 24 inch down there on the ground. This is the 61 inch. It's gonna be the same thing in both boxes. So I'm gonna go ahead and unbox the bigger box. Alright, so right on top you get all the mounting brackets for mounting various lights like the Kessels. And then beneath that is the actual light. Alright, that's the unboxing portion. Now all we have to do, connect the lights together with the included brackets. Okay, I went ahead and I installed the suspension hardware. All you have to do is loosen these up and they slide right in the ends here. Uh, this end wouldn't go in, so I actually loosened it up all the way and took the little nut and slid it in from that side all the way back down here. Now all I have to do is uh, install the end plate. There's just two screws in each end, one here and one here. So four screws on this end, four screws on that end. All right, both end plates are installed now. Um, you use the longer the screws and the uh, end goes around the electrical cord here. The only complaint that I've really saw about these lights online is that the electrical cords come out opposite ends, way down here. I did see someone online that did rework the electrical components and had both cords come out the same end, but um, I'm just gonna leave it as is and we'll see how it does. The weight is not bad. For a fixture that is 61 inches long, this is not bad. Uh, now time to go ahead, remove the uh, protective coating on the reflectors and get the bulbs installed, and then we'll get this hung above the tank. All right, I got the light flipped over. I'm gonna go ahead and remove the reflector protective coating. And now time to install the bulbs. I went with uh, two blue plus, one antennic, and one purple plus. I'm gonna do a blue plus on each side, an antennic, and a purple plus on the other side. So I'm gonna go ahead and get these installed now. Okay, last bulb installed. One thing make sure you do is write the dates on them. This is very important to do so that you make sure you replace your bulbs about once a year. Um, these bulbs do not have active cooling over them, so they might not last as long as bulbs that do have actually cooling over the top of them. But yeah, that's all to it. Um, this light looks really great. It's definitely not that bad on the price and definitely something to look at if you're looking at supplementing with a hybrid fixture. All right, so I got the fixture all installed. Everything is looking great. I kind of see how it looks underneath here. 16 inch LED fit perfectly between there. And I'm getting a lot more fuller uh, light in here. Thanks for watching and make sure you hit the thumbs up button if you enjoyed this video. Also make sure you subscribe so you don't miss the next videos I will be posting and leave your questions, comments, and suggestions below.